Obviously, Laura Kelly is in this house right now, but there is concern that Dennis Pyle could keep Derek Schmidt from being here next year. I think I want them both out of there. I want, I want Dennis Pyle in that capital, in that uh, mansion. Dennis Pyle left the Republican Party in June to run as an independent candidate for governor. In our latest Fox 4 Emerson College The Hill poll, Pyle got nearly 5% of our respondents' support, while the difference between Kelly and Schmidt was just 3%. So you do think you could have an impact in this race, even if you don't win? Oh, absolutely. Look, you have to ask the question, Jonathan, who has the most to lose in this race? And it's the two-party system. It's the, the two parties are the uniparty. And do they want to relinquish that power of the two-party system? No, they don't. If it's super close and Kelly pulls it out, pile, yeah, the, the pile factor is huge. Bob Beatty is the political science chair at Washburn University in Topeka. If she wins like she did in 18 by, you know, three, four, five points, you know, she probably would have won regardless of pile. But boy, yeah, you've got a story if she if she squeaks out a victory. Now, Schmidt's campaign says that D.C. Democrats are behind a recent radio ad in support of Dennis Pyle, but because the group's a 501c4, according to the Kansas Secretary of State's office, that group out of Washington, D.C., the American Center, does not have to release who their donors are. Christelle?